Hi Capricorns, this week we start Virgo season and at the end of the week we have our new moon in Virgo. So whole new season to get our teeth into and for you in particular this is a really nice season because you are an earth sign, Virgo is an earth sign so therefore this is a season that you can actually feel very comfortable in. So what we are going to be experiencing is a little bit more groundedness, a little bit more focus on the solutions rather than just kind of taking action and, you know, being fabulous like in Leo season. This is a little bit more serious and kind of, um, you know, conscientious and like, OK, this is my situation. What can I do about this? How can I move forwards? How can I find small ways to adjust my situation? and actually have the benefit that I want or have the solution that I want. So for you in particular, this is going to be a chance for you to actually expand a little bit because you are somebody who is usually very focused on the long term goals. And so Virgo season reminds you that it's not all about that. It's actually all about the day to day stuff as well. Once you've got your long term goals, that's great. You don't have to keep adjusting them, right? But it's actually the day to day stuff that brings you closer to what it is that you want, whether that is, uh, you know, a great career or a healthy relationship you know it's all these little moments of self-improvement that they all start to accumulate and so this is really important for you to remember this throughout Virgo season that it's the little things that count not the huge moves so your cards are the Queen of Cups and the Eight of Swords. So the Eight of Swords is very similar to what I was just saying. Um, try not to get too caught up in like, oh, I need to have the right move to move forwards because that can lead to analysis paralysis and then you won't, won't end up doing anything. Um, so this is basically saying that have a little bit of compassion for yourself, be a little bit softer with yourself and then actually the answer will come to you instead of trying to force yourself all the time because you can get stuck in overthinking and you know if this has been the case recently, then this is a sign for you to just step back and just you know give yourself a little bit of TLC give yourself a little bit of grace period um, and then you will start to understand what to do to move forwards and not analyze it so much so have a fabulous new moon guys if you want a reading there are links below as always and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next week